Welcome to this product update video from Bowers. Now, many of you will be familiar with the famous Bowers three-point bore gauging system, interchangeable heads, ranging from to measure diameters from two millimeters all the way up to 300 in this style of gauge, or in inches, 80 thou all the way through to 12 inch. So setting the gauge is very easy. We use the wing gauge that's supplied with it. We simply enter that into the gauge, set, the, set to the preset of the, of the ring, and we're ready to go. We're measuring anywhere in that 35 to 50 millimeter range in this case. And that's where this Bowers famous feel and repeatability comes from. We get that one micron repeatability without any real operator skill required. You may also be aware of Bauer's ability to design application specific versions of these standard heads for measuring other internal features such as grooves, threads, uh, ball races, um, and, and other internal features like splines, etc. Um, and to make things easier, we've taken some of these more popular applications and we've designed standard heads. And today, I want to show you one of our standard groove head sets. So, this set covers from 20 millimeters through to 50 millimeters with, or three quarters of an inch up to two inches, using three heads. It comes with the two setting rings, just like a regular Bowers XT set, and the all important um, XT3 Holmatic pistol grip controller. This controller will work with any head from three quarters of an inch up to four inches, or 20 millimeters up to 100. Now, the difference with the groove headset is the profile of the anvils. And the anvil profile has been stepped down, as you see here, to allow access into a, an entry diameter and then to allow the anvils to, to come into the groove, full depth of the groove, to measure the groove diameter. So, I set it in the, in the normal way. You can put that in a setting ring, use the depth stop provided to, um, to ensure a square setting. There's my 34.927 gauges set. And if we look at a typical component like this, you can hopefully see there's a groove in there. I'm gonna use this front face of the groove anvil to ensure the squareness. So if I just retract, beauty of the pistol grip, we can retract those anvils very quickly, get it into the entry diameter, past that, allow the anvils to expand into the groove. And I'm just gonna take the, the pressure off and just allow the part to square up using the front face of those anvils. So now I've got a nice repeatable result. And then in this case, I can retract the anvils. I've got my data measurement there. I can go further into the bore, use the depth stop to square me up and measure the diameter too. So using the Bluetooth function, I can very quickly combine these measurements and send the results um, to this free app and allow um, data measurements to be stored. So let's again, let's just show you that retracting the anvils into the groove area, square up the component using the an anvil face, send the data, come down, use the depth stop, which is part of the standard set, and measure that standard diameter. Next part, into the groove, square up, send, into the diameter, send. So I'm now combining groove diameters and regular plain diameters using the same set by the use of this um, acetal uh, depth stop. The app is free, just download it from the App Store, and that gives you a, a very useful application to take that data quickly, store it, and use these sizes to calculate the process capability. So, groove sets, now a standard Bowers part, um, they're available in set form to cover from groove diameters from six millimeters all the way up to 100 millimeters. And obviously for groove or other internal applications, 
they're a little more difficult or challenging than that, please call us for a quote. We still have the full specials capability. Thanks for watching.